You know, I think it's the atmosphere around Brandywine. Alan, beginning with him, such a wonderfully inviting person. You can see the history, like all around the place. You see all these prints from great artists, some people who I knew personally and some who I didn't, but admired for years. It seemed a place that was saturated with the atmosphere of working artists for many years. And Alan, he has that history of having worked with all of these artists. And then you have the master printmakers who are there and other people who stop by. I felt at home there, that I was becoming part of a legacy and becoming part of a kind of artistic family. And that's, that's what was great about it. Offset litho was considered a graphic medium and not a fine art medium. I mean, what was considered fine art would be like lithography, etching, woodcut, linoleum, cut, silkscreen, et cetera. Offset was not considered a, a fine art medium. So I would say the workshop was kind of pioneering. It gave you a full range of color. This particular process gave you an access to beauty more so than the fine arts, I should put it, mediums. It, you could kind of break the boundaries and produce something that had the subtlety that a woodcut wouldn't have. Murray Zimley had wrote a book on stone lithography, lithographic printing, mm -hmm. and he came in on first day and he said, I wrote a book on lithography, so I'm here to challenge you on your offset lithography. So I said, fine, but it really is on you to make the drawing, then we'll print it. He made his drawings, you know, like he was drawing on a stone and everything. He printed it and he said, hmm, okay. Well, can I do a portfolio? Then when he got the hang of it, he could see how the drawing was translating from plate to paper. He improved, improved, and towards the end, we were kicking him out. He did a portfolio, 12 prints in five days, two of them with two colors. Edition might have been 40 or something like that. He couldn't believe it. He was sold. He even signed up to come back years later and do a color print. Yeah, so that's, that's a good memory. 